So, George Cambosa's and his camp was training in New York somewhere. I forgot the gym. And I guess Tia Fimo and his camp pulled up. Things almost got heated. Um, Tia Fimo Sr., Mr. Tough Guy, you know, decided to step to I think that was George Cambosa's father. He decided to step to him and he got slapped or snuffed up because you can see his head kind of moved to the right a little bit. Either that or he got his ass draped up. <laughs> hey, listen, man. See, your female father better slow the swear slow his roll, man. Somebody gonna knock his ass the fuck out one of these days. He keep on his mouth. He talk too much, man. That's where Tio get his get his um his mouth from. He get that shit from his father, bro. Talk too damn much, man. See, the only only thing that Tio father Tio senior ever said that made sense was when he said Kenny Porter should have never said that about Sean in front of everybody after the fight. I totally agree with that. But everything else that come out that dude mouth. Is pure poppycock. <laughs> the dude is a trip, man. He um he almost got his ass, almost got his ass whooped going in there trying to be tough, and then you see Tio giving um giving Cambosa that ten gallon stare, you know, like hey, yeah, I'm like I'm tough. I got him. I'm gonna fuck you. Up. I'm tough. It, it was just it was just awkward to watch Tio just stare. He just looking at him like. He, just trying to put this tough guy persona on. It's like, you can just see right through the bullshit, man. You know, tomorrow, my son gonna knock your son out and run, and run around, bitch. Just be ready for that one round knockout, bitch. Man, somebody need to grab a hold of T.O. Father and sit his ass down somewhere. Like, yo, Pops, look. Sit your geriatric ass down and, and, and stop trying to, you know, get in the mix. He remind me of Robert Garcia of, um... What's his name? Oh, man. Angel, uh, what's his name? Robert Guerrero's father is like that. And Danny Garcia's father. Just like that. Two loud mouths, man. Two fucking loud mouths. Always hyping everybody up. But probably ain't gonna bust a fucking great, man. You know, but it would have been interesting to see, you know, but see, that's how bad things happen, bro. Like, you, I know they probably trying to sell a fight, but, you know, you pulling up to the, to the dude's um, gym and all of this stuff. To cause problems, man, and then suppose, suppose you know somebody threw a punch and then all hell broke loose in that in that in that fucking um, gym. People started going to jail. What if Tio ended up getting into a fight outside the ring? Fucks the whole fight up. Like, what are you trying to pull, man? You know, so and this dude is funny. I mean, I'm all for like um, entertainment and all of that, but you ain't had to get up in the dude's face like that because that shit could have end bad. If you're gonna do that, man, do it after the fight, man. Let them fight, cause you don't want you don't want nothing to jeopardize the fight, man. I'm, I really feel like that. You know, just like when Clarissa Shields camp, when they knocked out, when they punched old boy out, I really didn't like that shit. I think her brother knocked old boy out, man, from the opposing camp. I forgot the guy's name that he that they that they punched out. But he was an older dude, you know, shit like that, man. Like I, I'm not really with shit like that, you know, but. It was interesting, it was entertaining to watch that, but I mean, it could have went bad. You don't want things like that to go bad before the fight, man. But, yo, man, somebody need to put a leash on Tio Fimo Senior, man, because one of these days, they, yo, I'm telling you, he going he gonna, to uh, end up getting into the wrong shit. His mouth going to write him a check he can't cash, and somebody going to sleep his ass. I'm telling you, <laughs> you're going to see like a crowd, and you're going to hear Tio Fimo Senior running his mouth. Yo, my fuck, I'm... Oh fuck my son! Oh fuck your son, oh motherfucker! You you gonna hear all that, and then you gonna hear you gonna hear a punch, and then you gonna see Tio see his hat fly fly up on top of his head. <laughs> you ain't gonna see, well, you ain't gonna see, you ain't gonna you gonna all you gonna see is his hat just boop go fly up in the air. Somebody gonna crack him right in the jaw, knock his old ass out or something like that. Man, you better slow down. But what y'all thought about that little altercation, man, between um. Camp Cambosos and um, Camp Lopez, man. Unbelievable. But um, drop a comment. Let me know how you feel, man. I'm going to catch you guys on the next one. And I'm off this.